Welcome to another edition of Extremely Cocky's War Review. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get the war log up. Um, so I have the war against um, OJ, sorry, OG, Kush Kings. <coughs> and uh, we beat them 66 62. And the highest score they got against us, uh, sorry, the uh, highest three stars they got against us was against base number 10. Uh, which is our lowest TH9. Highest three stars we got against them was on base four, um, which I believe was Rich. Yes, it was. Let's just go ahead and have a look at that attack. I'm apologising for the commentary in advance. I haven't seen any of the uh, <laughs> any of these attacks. Um, so he's uh, going to open it up with a uh, earthquake. And um, we've got golems and wall breakers to get us in. Although the wall uh, golems have gone for a bit of a wander. Not to worry. <coughs> so we've got four peckers, bunch of wizards and witches behind them. Heroes are coming in. And we've got a couple of witches in the clan castle. So yeah, the main kill squad avoided the earthquake which is uh, a bit of a shame so we're about to rage the queen and cool kill squad joins in and now we've got some cover for the queen finally pop that hound still don't know why people put hounds in clown castles And with the heal, the queen is back up to full strength, um, and we've still got uh, kings and peckers and witches and wizards walking around the outside. Those golems broke into the middle just at the right time to allow this queen to clean up behind them. King's still got his ability, which I imagine we'll see any time soon. This queen really is destroying the entire base. And eventually he rages the king. Now we did win this war, but as you're about to see, it was only because these guys were so bad, um, because we failed to uh, three-star any of the high TH9s, which is where it's normally won and lost. Um, so the next highest three stars is Dink, and I don't think I've featured Dink before, so um, let's have a look. Um, so they, uh, this is their top TH8. Um, Dink's a new TH9. So we've got a bulk standard go wipe here. He's put the peckers down before um, clearing the outside buildings, uh, so that's why his peckers have gone for a walk. Got to funnel correctly. So eventually we get in. <coughs> and those wall breakers have got all the way through to the centre there. We've got a clan castle back up. He's uh, going inside, and also the uh, the other two peckers have. have double backed for whatever reason lots of compartments to get through on this one So 
so the peckers have broken back out again although we've still got the level five in the middle we've lost all the heroes and we've got uh, a whole four or five wizards uh, following the peckers around Those poor old golems are stuck. Well, those wizards just saved that level 5 pecker there. Oh, we've lost a golemite to a spring trap. And eventually, with uh, eight seconds on the clock, oh, no, four seconds on the clock, three, two, one, get it, yes. Um, well done, Dink, great three stars there, mate. Um, let's have a look at uh, Clash of Clans Most Heroic, um, which was uh, Shirley. I'm guessing this is a Dragon Splash, oh no. We've got a uh, go ho with a shitload of wizards. So, we've got no poison. Eventually those wizards get the uh, dragon and the loon. So in come the hogs, two finger drop. And there goes the uh, last two heels And we just got some clean up. And fantastic three stars there from, uh, from, well, it says don't, so I'm not going to say it. Um, <clears throat> let's have a look at today's feature okay we're gonna feature gem so gem did base 19 Tick, 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 19, and uh, I can almost guarantee this is Dragon Splash, yeah. So, uh, Gem's going to take out one of the air defence. There go the lightning. She's dropped her king down here for a bit of bait for their king, I guess. So Gem's coming at the two remaining air defence in a straight line almost. Just clearing some outside buildings to direct her dragons uh, in the right direction. We've got the clan castle loons coming in behind. So the king there has uh, done really well because he's taken out those defences which means the dragons will automatically fan out towards the air defence. And the king's actually managed to take down an air defence as well. 
Uh, it's more or less game over from here on in. The uh, blower's facing in the wrong direction. And the King's only just gone down now, having uh, taken out half the town hall. He did really well. So town hills down. We got dragons clean in the outside, dragons in the center. Pretty textbook dragon raid. And we just got some uh, debris to clear. Fantastic three stars there by Gem on her opposite number. Um, so that brings us to the end of another war review. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll bring you next one as soon as I can. Cheers, guys.